What's up guys, Richard is here on YouTube. Uh, you know me as 12 Weeks Out. So it has been a journey. Um, it's been over a year and eight months now that I've been growing out my hair. My most popular video was most likely the one that I did almost two years ago, and that was my flex belt review video. Funny enough that all the comments that I received back then on that video was commenting on my hair at the time rather than the actual content of that video. What? 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 Which I found <laughs> pretty funny. I mean, I kind of expected it because I honestly was a little self-conscious about my hair at that time because I went to the barber and I got the haircut and they fucked up, they went a little bit too high, and uh, I'm just like, okay, whatever. Oh yeah. And you know, at the time I was excited, so I made the video, and you know, lo and behold, what I expected still happened, and you know, <laughs> there were some comments that I really found funny. I mean, honestly, I have thick enough skin that I don't really care. You can say bad things, you can hate, you can be kind, you know, I love the good comments, uh, but it doesn't really affect me much, okay? Uh, the best comment that I read was um, the, <laughs> the haircut style of North Korea or something, I don't know. It was something like that, but it, it, it made me laugh for a good like 10 minutes and you know, thank you for that. Uh, which brings me to today's video, okay? So I want to be very transparent. I'm, a, I'm an honest person, so I'm trying, always trying to find new ways to do things. And you know, I posted up to YouTube thinking that I can make like a passive income because you know, hopefully I don't have to do what I have to do the rest of my life. So uh, full transparency, uh, I found a way to solve one of the main, uh, one of the big problems that Asians face. It is a problem that we faced forever. Growing up as a millennial, hairstyles of today are all, you know, Western based, so they're very, you know, sleek. Man, I'm pretty. They're very uh, neat looking. They're just very aesthetic looking for men, and it's usually uh, hair that is short. If I try to recreate that style. Well, if any Asian try to recreate that style, we come face to face with the fact that our hair is much stiffer, so when it's short, it grows out like this puffy lion mane. Uh, literally, like a Dragon Ball Z character, one inch or two inches long, our hair is growing out sideways in every angle. Hispanics don't suffer from this. Caucasians and black don't suffer from this. Uh, for one, when they get a haircut, they look good. And when we get a haircut that's short, I, I really, I think it would look good, but maybe for like three days. And then after that, some length will grow out and again, we'll be suffering from this uh, chihuahua head. The main thing was trying to find a way to style my hair. Doing those hairstyles didn't work out for me, so I had to grow out my hair longer. Uh, else, you know, it would be like straight up pineapple head. But here's the main thing, guys. The main thing I wanted to get across was the side hair. This is the part that us Asians always suffer from. We always had three or four options or remedies that we can do. So it's either keep our hair short and get a haircut every week or two weeks. Uh, so then we can avoid having this little bulge here while the top is doing whatever it's doing. Another one is constantly washing your hair in the morning, blow drying, and then using product to keep it down. And you would think that that's not that much work, but it really is, it's time consuming, and you know, it's some people like me, it's just not worth the effort. And yeah, I just don't wanna do it. Well, option three is growing out your hair, in the sense that once it gets to a certain length, it'll start coming down. But then the problem with that is, since you have so much hair, that like the length that you have to grow for it to fall down, it still kind of looks like this of uh, like droopy claw or something like that, you know? And that was not an option. And I've tried every single option that I can find, any solution that I can find to have a decent length on my side, because I 
I have a small head or I have a cone head as you can see in my <laughs> my flex bell video it's just like if you cut too high and you don't leave the top long enough to just kind of like even out the straightness you just look like a big cone and it's just <laughs> not <laughs> what I wanted uh, and I'm sure a lot of people don't either uh, if they suffer from that. I did all those options and years have passed and now recently uh, I've been watching these like Korean dramas and the actors I've noticed that all of their hair are very tight. They're, they're flush. They're flush down to the scalp and it looks you know like they don't have this problem like they don't suffer so I was just like what the hell's going on did a little digging and I found the solution and I found a very good solution uh, so yes again full transparency you know I am trying to make a living so that's why I put it in an ebook and I set it up and I'm selling it on Amazon Kindle uh, it's a very short read maybe six to ten pages not even sure depending on the font that you read it at but you know it's a quick solution I give you a little background on the story behind it uh, I'm, I'm selling it for the bare minimum of uh, $2.99 and you know like the information I believe is totally worth it so uh, I'm gonna put the link in the description box if you are interested you can just order it uh, for today into tomorrow today is a Monday uh, not sure when I'm gonna upload this but I'm gonna upload this today so today only for 24 hours maybe like maybe it'll go up to like 30 hours this book is free you know uh, I wanted to thank all my watchers so you know like if you did follow me and you <laughs> actually care about my stuff then you know like that's a little appreciation for for you from me because uh, you know like it always helped that you know people watch my videos and you know I thank you for that so if you go on Amazon today you can grab it completely free uh, after that I'm selling it for $2.99 and that's the bare minimum Amazon Kindle will let me charge um, yeah I hope this this information will help you uh, it definitely save me time money and frustration and uh, I'll see you next time <laughs> Woo!